let us introduce the apps functions. From from page we have the dashboard, which you can notice the center's movements at one glance. Okay, this will be the function of the settings. We introduce the system firstly. Factory reset algorithm. You can set nine axes with magnetometer or six axes without magnetometer. We change to six axis algorithm. Okay, and uh, we go to calibration. If your center is nine axis algorithm, it is not recommended to use the reset ZS angle to zero degree. You can reset now. Okay, center going back to zero degree on Z axis. Okay, now we are going to change it, back, go back to nine axis. Okay, and uh, let's try the second functions. Installation direction. The install direction will be horizontal, which means zero, zero, zero degree. And uh, if you need to set a vertical, rotate the Y axis. And after you set the vertical installation, you go back to the horizontal place. You will receive, you will notice the S angle will show minus 90 degrees or, my, or 90 degrees directly. So you need to set the horizontal installation direction. Go back to horizontal. Okay, the centers will slowly go back to zero degrees for horizontal installation. Okay. And now you can also change the name. You need to input the Bluetooth name. For example, WT, and uh, we set the number one, two, three. We hit OK. Device name is changed, and then you need to reconnect the sensor. Go back to connect. OK, now the WT123 is successfully renamed, enabling the scanning, connecting. Go back to my device. OK, we use this sensor, and we move on, introducing the functions. We go to calibration. For the acceleration, calibration, and we, let's try the first one. We hit the sender and place the sender for stay in the horizontal place for three seconds. You will receive the angle X and Y both go back to zero degrees, and you can check acceleration. You will receive exactly one G in the Z axis because of the, the Earth gravity. So this will be the function of calibration of acceleration.